everybody. Wednesday. Yeah, we're starting the weekend count day down. Hump day, bang to Friday. Ooh. And we're here today talking about sweeter than pizza dough. Hey, some of you might have come here to think about, you're gonna learn about how to make pizza dough. Nah, we're gonna talk to you how to make cash dough, cash flow, get the cash so you can go, go, go. There is dough involved because we've got a sweet treats bakery here today. So you're definitely gonna learn how to make some money. She is making dough, guys. All kinds of dough, well, batter, I should say, cake batter, cookie batter. And, and all sorts of edibles, and I'll let you use your imagination. Mm, so we have a one hour episode <laughs> planned for you. Stick and stay, we've got a lot of fun engagement involved. So I don't know, Corey, what do we do next? We got our first, we got, we're going to have our first place pony drawing. We're going to interview our fabulous guest and we'll have a second drawing all in this hour. And of course, we're going to end with a plant-based treat. But none of that can get started unless we thank the people who power this broadcast. Mm. Today's broadcast is brought to you in part by promotional considerations paid for by the following unmuted sponsors. Hey, here are our sponsors. We are so grateful. Corey, I say we get it going with our sponsors. Like we have to thank them, right? So I'm good. They're unmuted already. All I'm going to do is hit the play button because we got our reigning champs and it's her birthday hey, today. David and Christine Brooks. Happy birthday, Christine Brooks. Supreme sponsors, mm. David and Christine Brooks. 25 again. Hey, again. Supreme sponsor, Dr. Linda Bailey Hayden of Elizabeth City State University. Oh, 99 coffees and decaf ain't one. Yes. You or your company can become a sponsor. Visit blindguyhiswife.com. All right, that does it for our sponsors. So let's go, let's go, <laughs> let's start the show with our real talk with the topic design intro. Hey, let's this go. This is another episode of a blind guy. His wife. <laughs> <Here's my> wife. <laughs> Hey everybody, I'm Corey the Blind Guy. His wife, Laquita Marie. Together we let you enter our life live. Every hump day, bang, to Friday. That's Wednesday. Thursday. Friday at? <laughs> 11, 15 a.m. Eastern, Eastern Standard Time. Eastern Standard Time. Thank you. Uh, thank you. <laughs> On this journey, we spend an hour with you as we introduce you to fabulous guests who are helping to change your narrative of what you think it means to be normal when, you come to, when it comes to your health, your business, and your wealth. Today's fabulous guest is doing it all. She's concerned about people's health mm. because she makes plant-based desserts. She's concerned about her business because she's growing her business on all sorts of platforms. We're going to introduce you to Easy Tree today as well. Mm. Oh, and yes, that's true. Because as part of today's topics, we do have Easy Tree. I've never heard of it until now. So guys, you know, we're always bringing you something to level up your business. You're going to be impressed. And then she's also concerned about wealth because she is creating a legacy for not just her children. She is going to go commercial. She wants to get her private ship around the world. She's saying, move out the way, Sarah Lee. I'm coming through. Mm. Our special guest today is none other than Taylor's Kitchen. Hey, good morning. Good morning. How are you? Let me add her in so I can say she can say something back. <laughs> Hello. How are you guys? All right, Taylor, I know you like singing that ludicrous song to Sarah Lee and to uh, Ann Timmons and like, move. Because <laughs> you, you are, Taylor is coming through. So you are a, are you a, I know you're a certified chef. Are you a, specifically a pastry chef or are you, you specialize in all sorts of chefery? So I actually, uh, I went to school for culinary arts, so just food. But I, I found that I wanted to, um, I specialized cake for my twin's birthday party. And I couldn't find anybody to make the cake without it being an outrageous price. Mm -hmm. And they didn't want to even do the thing that I wanted to do. And so um, since it wasn't popular, I took a stab at doing it myself. All Here right. We are. So, you know, you say you took a stab at it, uh, you know, doing it yourself. And here we are. Your treats are pretty amazing. So this is going to be exciting to check this out. Um, of course, guys, we just have one hour today so that Taylor's going to be us, with us for one hour. But we will show you some really good things of hers because, I mean, it's you say, OK, you went to school to make a cake or I mean, to learn how to make your. To learn, say that again. She went to school to learn about food in general. Well, I mean, to, to, to save some money on your pastries and whatnot. 
but then you have these like amazing treats. So, okay, I know we're not supposed to be looking at this right now, but this is just <laughs> your, this is just your Facebook banner. So I'm looking at cookies and like your presentation. Um, no, not not yet. This full cake right here, I'm just showing snippets of it. These look like macaroons and stuff. Like you, you're doing real stuff here. Do you do the decoration, the presentation, and all of that, or are you just making the treats and someone else is staging the pictures? No, I'm staging the pictures. I'm doing the treats. I'm promoting all of it. Wow! Speaking of promotions, Big Guy Journey is in here. Oh, hey. oh my guy gosh! <laughs> the bro bro is in the house because I was going to talk about you, Tremaine. If you could come through, I was going to talk no, no, about no, you. No, 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 no. He's not just coming through. He's dropping dimes, jewels, gems, cash, y'all. We told you how to make cash dough. We bring on the money maker, and she brings the money. Thank you so much, Big Guy Journey. He oh. says I taught her everything she knows. Ah. Oh my goodness! Yeah. Leave it to him to say that. Yeah, yeah not everybody. We'll, we'll is. tell the truth. What happens is, uh, <laughs> Taylor's part of her business, and then Tremaine, Taylor's husband, and her children all in the background singing, All day long, we work so hard. <laughs> That's the sound of the men working on the chain. <laughs> you no, know, they working hard to eat the sweets. That's what they working hard to do. Exactly. Yeah, we so, know it's good because I when I when he wanted he said you know you should interview Taylor. He said, Man, she made this plant-based sweet potato pound cake. He sounded like he was eating peace just then. <laughs> I, I want some. Can, 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 can I get some? Can I get some? Now you know what? Speaking of can I get some, we're gonna get some more of Tamala Walker late late later because that's your business partner, right? One of your business partners on your podcast. Yeah, she is my co-host on our, our podcast. It's uh Tamla and Taylor's Treat Talk Tuesday. Right. Oh, so, right. okay. So you do everything. You're not just baking sweets. Uh, this is what I spoke about earlier. You got cash flow coming in, right? Because you have a podcast, you have a website, you have an online catering service, uh, in-person catering service. You're working with people across state lines. She's doing demos. People can log in and Tutor take tutorials with her. It's, this is all sorts of wonderful, wonderfulness coming out of Taylor's kitchen. And Tamla, now, is your middle name Sky? Sky. <laughs> Taylor Sky. Tamala. Oh, what, what do you mean? Her last name Walker. Well, yeah. Tamala Walker. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Her that's partner. I'm, I'm asking Tamala out there in the chat. It's her middle name Sky. Tamala, Tamala Skywalker. Tamala Skywalker. Skywalker. <laughs> you in the kitchen saying, oh, oh, get it, get it. Don't um, stop banking. We're only supposed to be saying good morning to you right now. Tasha Oshi Grows is going to enjoy this because oh, Tasha has a garden. Oshi Oshi, Oshi, Oshi Grows. grows. The same way you're using Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, she's using all the spaces as well. So she's going to be really excited to hear about Easy Tree. And Black Tropical is another one that uses all the social spaces as they learn about how they relate to business yeah, and growing. Charge. Yes, um, this is good. We got so many business people in the chat. Of course, David Hunt and so is No Okra, but we're going to ignore No Okra mm -hmm. because he played too much. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, he did miss the Easter Bunny Live, but let me tell you, everybody's excited to have you here today. My hey, Renaissance you. Grandma, Cassandra, yes. Dominic. I know I ain't talking to them. I ain't yeah, talking to them. On. Okay. Yeah, I ain't talking to you. Chemical Speed Spencer, stop talking to us. We're not talking to you, but she yet. loves food. That's why I had to put that up there. Well, Taylor, what we're going to do is usually, <laughs> we, usually we offer our guests in the green room some virtual treats, but since you make your own, just go grab something that you already made and enjoy that <laughs> green room. room. Yeah. Uh, we, Get this show officially started That's and we'll bring it. it back for the first place on the drawing. All right. All right. All right. This is going to be fun. Do you know Eileen Williams? Yes, that's my mom. Mm -hmm. hey, you my, know, I had to shout her out for it. My Duke's in the house. <laughs> All right, mom. You, you, you can you can tell me. Taylor and cool. we Taylor, were supposed to be on. saying hello. We got to say goodbye. Taylor and Tremaine, they were bad, won't we? <laughs> No, we weren't. <laughs> You probably broke like four belts on the neck. Uh, we will talk. <laughs> Maybe Tremaine. Uh oh, uh oh. Hey, look at him in there talking to no Oprah. See, he acting up. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so you can chill and relax while we get this show officially started. We'll be bringing you back shortly, okay? All right. All right, take care. Corey, I'm not supposed to be talking to them, but yeah. you know, Tasha Oshi oh, Grows was here, so then G Mama showed up. Uh -oh, G Mama Grows. Rose Alliance is in the house. Guys, we are still on today's topics. We're not talking to you, talk with Tori. So guys, no more comments for right now. You either Wally, but you know, my Nigerian friend, share with Love TV. Hey, share with Love the house. <laughs> well, you know what this is. Oh, brought... Felicia here too. Hi, Felicia. Hi, Felicia. <laughs> Front free. <laughs> guys, this is a one hour broadcast. One hour. Our 
first place pony drawing, our fabulous guest, a second drawing, and we also feature our plant-based treat. But all this is powered by StreamYard and by member support by viewers like you. you. Like T-shirt Tawana. Hey, girl. Hey, T-shirt Tawana. Oh, we ain't supposed to be talking to y'all. No. I forgot. Okay. I'm not <laughs> going to say hi. I, I may or may not say hi to N.A. Nia and Gail at night. What do that mean? Shut up. Can't you see this man is talking? <laughs> we got to get this broadcast on the walking. Okay, okay. This okay. broadcast is powered by StreamYard and by viewer support by members like you. You. That means you can be part of the blind guy, his wife, their life, home team. Mm. Just bum rush the button. Guys, all you have to do is hit the thumbs up. Of course, uh, Welsh Wifey Channel has already done that. She's Nigerian. I just had to say that because we got two Nigerians. I'm Nigerian, y'all. All right. Because Wally two and. Are two, uh, Two Nigerians. Nigerians tied up, tied up. Yeah, Wally and David yeah, Hunt almost why. had me as um Caribbean. yes, but you know, she gave us a thumbs up. Do what she's doing, guys. Give us a thumbs up. Like, That's your vote of like Tori would say lay hands on the like button. Absolutely. Lay hands on the like button. That's what Talk with Tori tells us to do. So do that, guys. It's the biggest vote of confidence that you can give us. And at the bottom of the screen, if you'd like to head on over to blindguyhiswife.com, you see there we have our sponsor scrolling. And of course, you can always join the ranks of sponsorship, or you can simply give us a virtual tip by buying us a coffee. Just click the green coffee cup so she can say, What you doing? And I'm going to say, Greg, you know what I'm doing. I'm about to stir it like coffee. Click, clink, 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 Yes. Head on over to blindguyhiswife.com. And thank you, Gail at Night, for dropping links in the chat, as well as David Hunt. Sorry, no okra can't get a wrench. But when you head on over there, you click the green coffee cup, it opens up a widget. And you can purchase one, three, five coffees, or even 25 coffees, because Corey has been blind for over 25 years now. And in this way, leave your name, say something nice. It shows how you're supporting the production. But... This is a nonprofit organization that's our parent company, and that's where the proceeds go to. And so, of course, you can see who else bought coffees. Thank you, JBWR. JBWR. Audrey Willis. Hey, Audrey, I said hi earlier, but I just Audrey wait. Audrey Willis. Uh, and Dale, Antoine, wait, everybody. So that's all you have to do, guys. <laughs> Click the green coffee cup. Okay, Corey, can we head into the comments now? Or do we have to no, give them a sneak peek? You got to let them know that they can get some fabulous merch there from Press of the Soul. And also, if you have an ashy ankles, then you can buy some, get some Violet Botanical skincare, help to relieve your family's <laughs> eczema. If you're in the kitchen and you're working like Taylor and you gotta wash your hands constantly, Violet Botanical skincare has body butter for the kitchen and the bedroom. Yes, the discount is built in. Just click the bread button and it takes you right over there for body butters, uh, skin scrubs, lotions, oils. You can keep it in the bedroom, the kitchen, wherever you want it. Why is big guy joining over there laughing? I'm not even supposed to be talking to y'all, but they keep talking to me. Okay. Anyhow. Sneak peek at the plant-based tree. All right. All right, Ronnie Weaver. This is just for you because she said good morning, Corey. Yeah, I know we're not supposed to be talking to them, but you know, we do. We should say hello to our favorite moderator, Philip Baldo Jr. DWJ. <laughs> all right. We're not talking to you guys. We're done. We're done. We're done. Hey, mama. That's Eileen Williams. Anyways. <laughs> Uh, guys, we are going to head on over to give you a sneak peek at today's plant-based treat. Since today's chef is a pastry chef, we thought we'd share something special because we're not vigilantes. We're not fruit hoodlums. We're not the plate popo. We just want you to increase the amount of fruits, vegetables, and whole grains that you eat in every meal. Every, every dessert every single meal even dessert and that's what today is about it's not about the fact that i um there's no more gray and so you know i let it all hang out hey no scarf today y'all know this only gonna last one day but anyhow Corey doesn't like to hear talk but i had to tell y'all because i kept trying to cover up the gray and so finally boom it's covered anyways uh gee Albert, what you talking about hmm looks good we haven't even gotten to the food yet and while he's calling us the plate popo we are not policing people's plates guys gk don't pay them any mind we're going to give you guys a sneak peek at today's plant-based treat. And I'm sure you will all agree that this shows that we're not fruit kublums. We're not vigilantes. vigilantes or any of that. This is a dessert. We have a lady on today with a sweet treat. So oatmeal breakfast cookies. We're going to boom breakfast cookies. We're giving y'all cookies for breakfast today. Now can we really cannonball yeah. into the comments? Time, roll call. Time to really cannonball into the comments. <laughs> but while you're doing that, make sure you hashtag the home team. You gotta hashtag sing that because Sony with the Y's in here. I mean, not Sony. No, no, that's Sony H. 
<laughs> the home team. That's on your H, but either way, sing it. She looks like she can sing. Hashtag the home team to enter your goat, your car, your plane, your bloat, your net, your rat, your cat, your dog, your horse, your buzzard into the first place pony drawing so that you can get bragging rights for coming in first place today. All right, absolutely. We are not giving Okra a wrench. Okra, get a wrench. Okra, get a wrench. You already know who's chanting for him. Philip. Yes, how you know? The old man, he'll say you read. <laughs> hey, uh, Black Tropical saying clink. You know what? Uh, <laughs> Tawana Harris is over here laughing. Let me say hi to Crypto Lead. Hey there, how you What's doing? Crypto Lead. Oh, you know, he's mentioning that he heard Phillip's uh, uh, great work the other day. You know, his great voice. Yeah, yeah, Y'all know yeah. Philip Waldo Jr. is a voiceover artist. And yes, he does his thing. So if you were there at the YouTube Yellow Pages on Friday. Friday last Friday, yep. Yes. So yeah, he, we got to hear some of his <laughs> vocal reels. Great for, for 15 second and 30 second ads. Also uh, doing documentaries and audio books. He's got all the talent that you need. Mm -hmm. And we're going to be tapping into that. We got a uh, launch of something special just for content creators. We'll tell you about that. But it's going to feature some of the fabulous talents that are right here on the home team. You already know. Philip Waldo Jr. is shouting people out. So definitely uh, we are excited to have him as a moderator. That's our favorite one. Um, why did G Mama Grows uh, say uh, hit that right there? What she say? Uh <laughs> oh, she's not probably messing with uh, Pastor Toy because he's 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 a Saint Lunatic. Yes, hit that right there. Hit that button here, right that right button right there, right here. Right, right. Ben, no, she said Bender, hit that. Hey, Duval, mm -hmm. City Girl Gardener. Duval. Yes. Hey, good, always good to see everybody hanging out in the space. You know, RG Willis was winning everything last night on Talk with Tori's game, Brain Games, Corey. Mm -hmm. So Talk with Tori has a brain game tomorrow night. We will be there battling Black's Tropical Homestead. It's all, all the gloves are coming off. Laquita and Sheree will be mud wrestling virtually while Bobby and I sit back and enjoy a nice cold drink from Wet Willies and watch the chaos happen. Mm. Because it's, it's going to be a word game and you know Laquita and her readings challenge. Oh, no, know, right? <laughs> Audrey Williams has put What's in their hashtag the home team. Grow F you. <laughs> Don't say that because I got Eileen Williams' name up there right now. We can't say that when somebody mama watching. But I said, bro, if you last week, guys, it was an accident. It was a mistake. <laughs> uh, just go back to the replay. Have a good time with it. I saw N.A. Nia up in here, but let me see who was first. Let me see who was first, first, first. Um, I think it was Wally or was it Black Tropical? Was it no okra? Ah, oh, I know me and Black Tropical. Okay, yes, we do have to battle tomorrow night, but... There was a couple of other people that we did not say hello to. Um, uh, I know we didn't say hi to Shine Moss Farm. Hey there. Shine Moss Farm. How are you? It might be Shine Moss. See, I know I still don't, don't know how to read that good, but. Is it Chine Moss? I know, right? Uh, Kine Moss. Inania is in there. And um, who is Audrey Willis saying happy birthday to? My mama. Thank you. I appreciate it. Hey. Yes, it's her birthday. Um, she's 25 again. Uh, I, I don't know which. which anniversary of her 25th birthday but while they're talking trash talking about i'm in the house laquita where my gift that woman corey i need you to handle that asap we didn't get the email while i i clear for god i did not see what the gift? email his digital art from the artist um oh Steffi, yeah, Steffi, 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 yeah, yeah. yes Yes, so she we'll waiting make sure. Send, she waiting for you to send your naked picture so she can actually do the artwork while you know what uh, me i'm waiting for a picture from mr handsome no. Oh, Mar Steffi is. Steffi is because she said she wanted to do a naked picture of Wanda. Nude you art know what? Wanda. No, she did not. <laughs> this is a daytime show. And just a very, hello, how are you? Don't pay Corey any mind. This is not typical for him. So please ignore yes, it. Is. <laughs> and while uh, Black Tropical is, is, was arguing earlier with no <laughs> okra. <laughs> talking about, I like okra meat. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Eileen Williams did say shalom earlier. And um, let me make sure I see who was first today. I, I clear it was no okra because no okra was up in there like. Rich. Yes, because you know Tasha. O oh, she grows now. He's, now I'm about to say Tasha okra. Look, <laughs> no okra, you're doing too much because you got me talking more crazy than I usually do. My Renaissance grandma, she was Vanessa in there. Buckner. Yes, she was in there early. Y'all know Vanessa Buckner shows you how, speaking of food, one of her latest videos, because she was doing shorts videos, mm -hmm. one of her latest videos, she was showing you how to make barbecue with mushrooms, mm -hmm. jackfruit. Mm -hmm. uh, I can't remember if she made her own dressing, but I know she made the, her own coleslaw. Mm -hmm. Yes. 
So no Oprah talking about still looking for a wrench. I'm first. And then David Hunt told himself, no Oprah. Mm-hmm. At no Oprah, you have to uh, have content on your YouTube channel to get a wrench. And then David Hunt says, Laquita and Corey are very particular about handing out wrenches. <laughs> you have to be special like Gail at Night, Trash Can Ways, Philip Walter Jr. Hashtag, I'm just saying. <laughs> Guys. Right, now, there's a rule of life, David. It's okay to talk to yourself. Just don't answer that. You're doing a lot. <laughs> David, you're doing a lot. And you did so well this morning. Y'all know David Hunt goes live every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, 6 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Because he's up there in Michigan. He's up there cold and waking up early. He's in Massachusetts. Yeah, that's what I, Lord, I'm making up. That's the trash can waves in the trash Michigan. Trash can waves in Michigan. And so is our guest today. Oh, she is. Well, yeah. let's get her in here to help us with this first place pony. Because you guys know, while we're saying hello to you, people like Share With Love TV, my favorite folks, because they're Nigerian. Uh, who else are some of my people in here? Oh, we only had two Nigerians so far, though, right? Yep, two. Okay. While we're talking and saying hello to you all, we're also giving you a chance to put in hashtag the home team. This way you can be in uh, in a race, so to speak, for first place pony. Because David Hunt was first. However, everybody can't be first, right? But wasn't Okra first? No, no. What? even no Okra made it first. No, no Okra doing too much. Um, Oh, Eileen says, thanks for the support for all the business. Absolutely. You know, this is what it's about, guys. Today's episode, you are going to find out how to make that dough, cash dough, not just cookie dough, not just cake batter, not just pizza dough. We're going to talk about making that cash dough, cash flow from our special guest today, which is Taylor. All right, so CTW Coaching is in here saying hello, family. So hey, CTW. Yes, also Matilda Film TV. Hey, so, oh, another Nigerian. Oh, hey. Three in the house. Yes, so I'm definitely Nigerian today because, you know, in Nia, she is not Nigerian. I forgot where she told us she was from. Is she from Michigan, too? I keep making up stuff. Well, she in Texas. I, I just be lying. Somewhere in the United States of America. Okay, Mama has it in there. I, Miss Eileen has hashtag the home team, so yes. I say we bring in Taylor's Kitchen. Yes. Sweet sweet, treat spirits. Oh, right. (laughs) Taylor, good morning again. Hello, hello. Hey. Wait a minute, wait a minute. CTW uh, coaching said that sweet potato pound cake changed the game. We we don't have to talk about that. We can't even get into anything else. (laughs) Taylor, you you are doing your thing as far as business is concerned. But what people really want to know is how you got started and that's the first talking point <laughs> that we're going to bring up today which is oh so of course we do want to get into your pastries and profits like how you're balancing both of these because you know you're making money um tell us some of your backstory like how did you get started did you bake as a child were you cooking or did you just say like praying cup praying couple cooking series. I can cook. This can do something for me. Now they pray for people and they do a lot of giving. Um, with you, you have turned this into a business though. So how did you get started? Cause big guy journey is in there laughing. Tell us about it. <laughs> so, um, I got started, like I said, I went to culinary school and when I was in culinary school, we had to take one semester of baking. And so mm. it was maybe like, I don't know, like maybe like four weeks or whatever, four to six weeks. So that one semester of baking, and then I went on to, um, I moved to Hawaii. I got a job on a cruise ship. Oh, and so, I want to yeah. hear more about that. Cause you know, we always want to uh, go on the cruise ship. Girl, we're going to talk about that after. We're not giving everybody the game. <laughs> go ahead, go ahead. Yeah, yeah. So, yep. So I went to Hawaii and I worked on the cruise ship and then I started a family. And like uh, when I started a family, I wanted to, you know, do the big birthday parties and things at first. Mm. Uh, And so I needed a cake for a birthday party for my son. And so I wanted a specific theme, but, you know, the normal places you go to, the Walmarts or like the, you know, Sam's Club, they weren't doing anything custom. It was just, you know, the regular characters that you see on the TV screen. So my children were watching VeggieTales at the time. And so I wanted to make them a VeggieTales birthday cake or get somebody else to make it, but I couldn't find anybody. And so I was like, uh, look it up, you know, on YouTube University, the different uh, cakes and stuff. And so we found, I found like 
I was like, I can make a Bob tomato, you know, only one little layer of cake. And so I tried it and that was the first cake that I made. Um, oh, so after... this was before you went to school? No, this was after school. Okay, because I was like, wait a minute, before even before you went, YouTube University was leveling you up. I, I remember <laughs> you saying you went to school, but then I was like, well, wait a minute, but you went, so, okay, wait a second. At school, they taught you the basics, but you learn how to level up on YouTube University. YouTube University. That's what you're basically. So yeah. you got nice. And this is so great because everybody's putting in hashtag the home team. Everybody wants to be a winner just like yourselves. Uh, JBWR, one of our sponsors, uh, has it in hey, here. JBWR, thanks for the sponsorship. And and one of the reasons why I said they want to be winners just like yourselves because your family, your whole family, you guys are such winners. You know, big guy journey. Your mom, Miss Eileen Williams, CTW coaching. I see somebody says, oh, that's her older sister. That's why she know about the pound cake. Right, right. Yeah. I was going to <laughs> and you 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 definitely definitely leveled up because you've gone from just you know maybe the layer cakes to doing basically like three dimensional cakes with the different molds and things like that and decorating. You had one cake you did for one of your for your uh, son it was a transformer cake. So you uh, was it Optimus Prime or was it uh, Megatron? Which one was? It? <laughs> he likes Bumblebee. Oh, okay. All right. So Bumblebee. So yeah, so those, you know, all those different things, you know, you definitely taking this to a different level. <laughs> And we're going to tell everybody how you're doing that when we talk about your ingredients to, for success. Now, you know, Mad Acre Farms, they're another powerhouse for ingredient. <laughs> they are not mad. Corey's at the mad. That ain't how they act. <laughs> they are sweethearts. They have a commercial farm um, and they both have marketing backgrounds. So I think you'll you'll be able to speak to that because the they're way- not far from you, they're in Iowa. Oh, absolutely. Oh, okay. Yes. And so the same way that you're doing business across state lines, you know, right now they're local. They're not cruising out. Black Tropical says, yes, cruise me, please. Yeah. Girl, we're going to call oh, you later. you know what? That's what I was going to say. Uh -huh. See, y'all missed this. So you got to learn how to read between the lines. Okay. We're talking. Okay. Because she told part of her life story without telling me. Oh, well, Getty said, always telling his life story. Hey, Getty. What's up, Getty? <laughs> she said that she was working in Hawaii on a cruise ship. When she was done, did it, she started her family. Translation. She was supposed to be working on the cruise ship. <laughs> But she decided to go on the Lido deck oh. in her bathing suit. And that's where she met her husband. And you know that they're not supposed to mingle with the passengers. Right. So they had to get married. So they had to get married. No, my husband was not a passenger. He was <laughs> also a worker on the cruise ship. <laughs> <laughs> okay, keep it straight because no, XDMC, that, that, XDMC, just so that you know, she is married. Uh, he trying to get David Hunt to get some okra on this pizza and CTW. <laughs> yes, wait, we are talking about the food okra because David doesn't like okra. So, but wait a minute, but my story, my story is more intriguing. So <laughs> she was on the deck wearing her wearing her thong, 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 Oh and my then, god! And then her husband. This came is a daytime by. show. Her husband was on in the pool. And they had matching thongs, so they, 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 they hit it off. They hit it off, and then she got married right down the island, and then she got off the boat, and then she was she been baking ever since. That's how it went. Okay, that's a five minute story. So, story. That was a good made up story. That was very good. exactly. <laughs> but no. So this is the thing, Philip Waldo Jr. Keep trying to get some of those sweet potato pound cakes. I'm like, they ain't real. I don't believe it. Just give me three. Give me two. <laughs> so. Um, do you ship? Let me ask this because Eileen Williams is saying she has the best son-in-law ever, so that's good. Oh, okay. You know, I guess that thong worked out. And then, um, <laughs> but do you do you ship or are you more local as far as you know cakes right and now. pastries? Right. Right at the moment, I'm more local with the uh, actual treats, but I do have different classes and I have uh, eBooks about how to enhance your cakes. And also I do demonstrations on the podcast twice a month. Right, right. You know, this is good. Mama, please cover your ears because they got all kind of adult talk on a daytime <laughs> show. They got nighttime talk. And G opposite my must be a difference in working W E R K on a cruise ship versus work <laughs> versus cruising on a ship. <laughs> nah. Look, well, yeah. this is so much fun because go ahead, Corey. You were gonna say something. Say no, in all seriousness, that that's Ooh, cool. Miriam Adipul, I am Nigerian or uh, she's that she's Nigerian too. She's in California. <laughs> But she's Nigerian. But it's cool that you guys are both, <laughs> that, the real story, you guys are both working the cruise ship and y'all found each other there. And now y'all are stirring it up in the kitchen and making all sorts of magic with, for people. And you do have plans to go to go uh, interstate commercial with being able to ship out desserts. Is that true? 
Yes, yes. I am planning on that. I'm working on it right now. I just moved into a new location that's separate from my home. So mm -hmm. we are working on getting this place licensed so that I am able to ship all across the country. Oh, wow. wow, this is great. Mary Montepoju is saying your guest is looking super gorgeous. And uh, that's, <laughs> yes, that sounds like a gorgeous deal that you're talking about, like making sure everything is set up the right way. I know that uh, right now we're getting into our first place pony. As you see, Mary Montepoju has already put it in there. But I did want to ask really quickly, you said something about the cookbook and, you know, you have the ebooks and the tutorials and whatnot. And so... We're going to talk the, in detail about those and our ingredients for success, but go ahead. We will, because I was going to ask about this, uh, the podcast desserts cookbook. Um, we can listen to the podcast and we can get a cookbook separately. Like those are two different things, right? Yep. Those are two different things. So what we did is uh, we took our 12 most popular demos throughout the year and we, um, there are already videos and we put it into a cookbook so that you are able to look at the demo if you purchase the cookbook. And we also put in the 12 business tips because on our podcast, we talk about treat business and life. I love it. Right. Now, you know, I had to ask you one extra question because of course, CTW coaching was already in the chat saying she will win because her heart is true and her spirit is sweet. But of course, we're getting ready for our first place pony. So we need everybody to have in there hashtag the home team. Mary Amade Poju, she has it in there. But Melissa Jameson, Sonovia Ridley, hey, they call hey. me Sunshine. Hey, they hey. don't have it in there yet. So we want to make sure they have time. You want to beatbox the hello to them, Corey? I'll try. You ready? <laughs> or you can beatbox it for the giveaway. I don't know. Um, let's see. I got it. Supernova. Hey, girl. Hey, Supernova. How you doing? Yes. And they call me Sunshine and saying hello to everybody. They call her Sunshine. Sunshine. <laughs> Harlem Nights. She was the star of Harlem Nights. Sunshine. Okay. Big Guy Journey has it in there. Awesome. Awesome. Wally is still talking trash. The home team, the rig team, the fix team. <laughs> You know what? Thank you, Audrey, for uh, being good. Oh, uh, the, they call me Sunshine. Put a hashtag in front of it. Um, Audrey is chatting it up with everybody, so that's wonderful. Okay, let's get a, let's get it going, Corey. You can wrap it once we um, do the giveaway. How are we going to do it? Pressure on me now. Okay. You, you have to buy style. the e cookbook to find the secret ingredients to the okra sweet pie. <laughs> that's G. Albert telling them. <laughs> do you like okra? Let me ask you that. Um. I like it now a little bit more than I did when I was a child. It just depends on how you cook it. Cause some people, if y'all slimy and I don't like it when it's slimy, maybe when it's fried, I like it. Not when it's like stewed in the stuff. Try exactly. it raw. Try it raw. It'll change your life. Yeah, it's different raw. Okay, we can go, Corey, because Valerie yes, Singleton. XBMC, I like it raw. <laughs> Valerie Singleton has hashtag the home team saying good morning to everybody. And let's do the giveaway because Talk with Tori is telling you beatbox, Corey. So let's go for it. Uh, <laughs> Wait, you got to tell her what she's going to say. She's saying well, she can do this, so I'm doing it right now. Oh, okay. Oprah is not the devil, by the way. Oh. <laughs> No, it's hilarious. What we're going to do is I am going to give the horse race announcement. And when I say bring, when I make the gate sound bring, then what you're going to do is you're going to say, make that dough, make that cash flow. Oh, I like that. Okay. And oh, see, Taylor does eat okra when she goes to her sister's house and they call me sunshine and saying okra water is good. Wow. Okay. All right. okay. Tips here. We are not repeating this. Talking about, I'll say it again. O hashtag okra must be deleted. <laughs> 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 yeah, today's show is PG32. Like, what y'all doing in here? Let's get to the my first place pony. I was about to say my little pony. No. Oh, no. <laughs> Thank you, Valerie Singleton, for Where? supporting us. Okra's the best. Ooh, now, you talking about some beatboxing? Her daughter, we talked to her, her children the other day. Her daughter? Yeah. Boy, Taylor's kids was, are business yeah. people. That girl was rapping. Beatboxing. She had a whole <laughs> night. She was a whole on production. She was like Bismarck and and uh and Roxanne Shante. And so Salt well Pepper. spoken. <laughs> yes, just well spoken and ready for the world. So okay. Ready? Um, yes, I am going Share to the screen. Yes, it's up here. The, the home team. The unrigged 
unbiased, randomized selector is ready. It's ready, Coach Remy. You might win. I, I'm just saying. Hey, Coach Remy. Hey, we're winding that now. <laughs> Here we go. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another edition of the first plate. <laughs> Black Tropical did it to my My Little Pony, <laughs> so I had to sing it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we want all right. Here we go. Well, good morning, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to another edition of the Blind Guy's Wife and Life First Place Pony Derby drawing. Mm. All the jockeys are mounted in position behind the gates, ready to ride. Bring your turn, Taylor. You gotta say, make that dough something. Make that cash flow. Make that dough, make that cash flow. <laughs> hey, and they're all CTW coach and G Albert. Oh, I ain't even gonna say G Albert name. No okra, coach Remy. Uh, Philip Walter Jr. Why is no okra in there? Duval, Philip Walter Jr. Talk with Tori. In a Nia, they call me sunshine. Hey, they call me sunshine. <laughs> Can't ride in on a hey. mall. Can't ride in on a mall. That's what I'm talking about. Duval, in the daytime, it's still warm. Duval almost had it though. I, I saw that. I saw her name slowing down in there. But look, not this time in a Nia. However, uh, Tamla Walker says it can be. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean it can be? Oh, uh, well, we were talking earlier about Skywalker. Yes. Right yeah. Yeah. Get it, get it. Don't stop. Cook with it. Cook. <laughs> Anyways, uh, it's not rigged. All we need you right now to do. Let me see you make them cookies, make that cake, do the brown. Uh, <laughs> um, <laughs> Taylor. Do like Mary Mari Poju, G Mama Grows, and um, Valerie Singleton because they're all saying Gail at Night. Y'all know Gail at Night has a channel. David Hunt, drop Gail at Night's channel or Gail at Night. Drop your own that channel. would be kind of weird, but you can drop your own channel. Anyways, please congratulate. Uh, they call me Sunshine because she is the first place pony giveaway. Talk with Tori. Yes. Everybody is, you know, go ahead. Congratulate. Congratulations, it's Sunshine. They call me sunshine, sorry. Congratulations. Yes. We're going to put you back in the virtual green room where you can enjoy some of your own virtual treats. And you better not be back to eating the pineapple upside down. And your brother in there acting up. Without no coconut flakes. Without no coconut flakes. Without no coconut flakes. So, of course, David Hunt said rigged. Big Guy Journey said rigged. No okra said rigged. Of twice or three times. I don't know. But anyhow, um, Thank you, Coach Remy, for congratulating Philip Waldo Jr. Oh, CTW says you're gonna cook up some okra today. All and right. Duval is saying, Congratulations. Right. Say that one more time, okra fried. Long as it's fried. You know, a you lot of people it, like you get it. Right. A lot of people <laughs> like it fried. Do you dip it in anything or do you just eat it plain when it's fried? Probably just hot sauce. Oh, yeah, yeah that's good too. I've had it that way as well. It's DMC. How do I like my okra? Tell them, tell them. <laughs> We'll see you soon. We're going to put you in the green room to give you an official welcome this morning. Oh, thank you so much, Mama Williams. And a small blessing. Hey, every blessing is a blessing. We appreciate that. She thank has a you. super chat. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you so much. Uh, okay, put her back in the green room, Corey. All right, we're going to get you in the green room. We're going to let you enjoy <laughs> a, some computer chips and some software salsa with some virtual vino on the side. All right. <laughs> enjoy. All right. All right. So um, they call me Sunshine's acceptance speech says, if it's rigged, thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. We got you. And you know XDMC, raw. <laughs> Let's get on with the intro because, hey, Tamla Walker doing her thing. Super proud of my co-host, Taylor, as a businesswoman and excellent baker. Thank you for the $20 super thank chat. You, Amazing. Tamla Skywalker. We got all the business people. I told y'all there was money bags over there. Business people. <laughs> <laughs> and Black Tropical in there laughing at uh, XDMC. <laughs> Don't go along with him. Oh, Crypto Lee says there's a nice dish called C O U C O U Cuckoo. No, no, I want you to see it. Made from okra and cornmeal. Cuckoo or cow cow? Yeah, uh, probably cuckoo. I don't know. Yeah, that sounds good too. So OG Cuc Patrice. OG Patrice, Pistol Packing Patrice. She's the beast from the west to the east to say the leaves with a four five piece on her hip. She ain't talking up. No nah, I'm stop. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh, Miss Eileen says she's gonna win next time. Uh, hey, we got another drawing. We got definitely got another so sticky steak because we got another giveaway that we're gonna do later on. We do. Tamla Walker probably uh, is, is involved with it, but we'll let y'all know soon, right after this introduction, because we got to get on with the show. Y'all be quiet. Don't chat. Don't say anything because we have to enjoy our guest. What's her name, Corey? Guys, everybody, if you just joined us today, thank you for coming on to uh, <laughs> our show. It's called Blind Guy. His wife. Their life live. We hear from you every Wednesday, Thursday, Friday at 11.15 a.m. Eastern, Eastern Standard, Standard Time. Time. 
And we it change your narrative of what you think it means to be normal when it comes to your health, your business, and your wealth by introducing you to fabulous guests such as who we have today. This guest is a powerhouse chef that has turned pastries into profits, making cash flow by making sweeter than pizza dough. Mm. She is doing it all. She is such a dangerous culinary artist that Betty Crocker took her little wooden spoon, broke it, burned it, and threw the ashes in the ocean. This woman is such a culinary talent that Sarah Lee just gave up the ghost and stopped making sweet treats and went into making coffee. This woman puts everybody that you can think of to shame when it comes to the cooking game. Mm -hmm. Wolfgang Puck, Emerald Lagasse, all of them have to bow down to this member of the Big Guy Journey Posse. She is none other than today's special guest. She made Martha Stewart realize she couldn't do it. She made Paula Dean give up butter and only eat plain collard greens. This is how devastating of a talent this woman is. She is not only a businesswoman, she is a super mom, a super wife, a super sister, a super daughter. It's time for today's special guest. It's Taylor's Kitchen. Ooh, hello, welcome back, welcome back, welcome back. <laughs> Taylor's Sweet Treats, Sweet Thank Spirit you. Treats, guys. Sweet Spirit Treats. And we say Sweet Spirit Treats because scrolling there at the bottom of the screen, uh, you can see all of her places. But of course, our moderators are dropping them into the chat. So welcome back, Taylor. Everybody is excited to have you here. Look at Tamela Walker saying, so happy. Congrats, Sunshine. She's still congratulating people for the win. And Audrey Willis is like, all right now. And right. Soil Sister, that's, what, you know, that's Black Tropical, Corey. They are excited to have you here today. Like, not the ashes in the ocean, girl. You done took some bakers down, according to Corey. <laughs> yeah, she comes forward. boys. <laughs> she comes through throwing bows. Move, get out of here. Right? Well, Philip Waldo Jr. Thank is saying, you. You're welcome. You're welcome. He's saying, welcome to the show. We want to get into the nitty gritty of the ingredients yes, for success because you're taking your success, not just in the kitchen and what you're asking people are able to consume. You're giving, you have a, a, ongoing projects and products that people can last people a lifetime. Should they, should they, should they show choose, so choose to use it mm -hmm. because you're giving them information. You're giving them tutorials. You're giving them demos. You got the podcast podcast going with Tamala Skywalker. You have a lot <laughs> going on and we want you to introduce the world that some introduce to some and present to others as they say in church, but the easy tree landing page, we want to talk about that because these are all your ingredients for success, right? Yes, they are. So we use, I use Easy Tree. I've been using it for a little over a year now and I love it. It is a way that you, it is similar to Link Tree. You can add um, videos, you can add photos, you can add hyperlinks. Um, I also have my ordering system set up through her. Um, it is a young lady named Shawnee West. She created the system and mm. it has just been a great ingredient for success. I'm able to keep every, all my information there. I was even able to post the video on there that we are doing right now. So yeah, you know what? I'm going to, I'm going to pull that up because of course, Corey Sinovia is saying you deliver the best introductions. <laughs> you know, why is she looking like super cute on her, um, on her uh, avatar, you know, she done changed it up and leveled up. Okay, we see you, Sonovia. Uh, you know what, Wally? We are going to definitely, we're going to ignore you. Talk about speaking of treats, you got cookies. <laughs> yeah, we're going to show you. She's got some great cookies, some great cookie designs, and she's got a lot of plant based uh, treats this year. We'll talk about why plant based is important to her. Right. On the screen right now, this is your easy treat. So Easy Tree is sort of like Link Tree. I'm at the very top. And when I start to scroll, uh, like you're saying, you have different segments. So this is showing the video that where we are right now. We can click play. It plays right here within the Easy Tree. So that's nice. Podcast Desserts Cookbook. So if we click here, it'll take us to the podcast desserts page um, telling us about 
I think this took me to, let me see, let me just click it and see where it takes me to. It actually does take me to the, um, to buy the cookbook. That's where that mm -hmm. one takes me to. But yeah. so that means if I click the button here, the power of simple syrup ebook, I can buy books, uh, classes, I can stay connected, I can subscribe. And then of course you have your online system. That's what you were saying that your friend, um, before we get to the podcast, you were saying the friend set up the online ordering system, right? Yes, he did. So when we click this, it opens right into this beautiful page. So guys, Easy Tree, as you see, Gail at night, she's put it on the screen. Experience Taylor's Kitchen Online, easytree.me forward slash Taylor's Kitchen LLC. So when we get here, we can just order cookies and stuff. So tell us about cookies because we are now plant-based. You do have vegan cakes, vegan cookies. So tell us about a little bit about these ingredients for success and I know we talked about you. We want to definitely hear about the ingredients for success for your plant-based treats. Oh wait, but this opens up a whole nother menu. Oh yeah. so you can personalize the cookies or cakes or different things like that that you want to order. Oh okay. When you say personalized that means you can have them custom made to what you want. You can to add order. chocolate candies to gotcha. it, chocolate dip, chopped okay. nuts, edible image oreo crumble because up here you order it by the dozen so like one two three four dozens or whatever and then down here you can customize it as to what you want you know is that right am i explaining that correctly yep you are explaining it perfect right so she other, has dairy free and gluten free options but so in other words wow. i get some cookies that you can make look like the food like the food <laughs> like me you know what <laughs> oh i can definitely put a picture on a cookie i have made cookies like that before um sugar cookies with edible images i've done paw patrol i've done um chocolate covered pretzels whole birthday party themes with the cake cupcake cookies. and you do cake oh. pops because they call me sunshine saw those on instagram i was showing how cake pops are made Corey. Mm. but go ahead because um G. Albert is saying that Miss Taylor, love the light behind you. Nice presence. Your audience presence is also great. You are looking directly at us and engaging us into your code. See, G. Albert is a tech guy. He does production. And so he's noticing like. No, no, mm -hmm. translation. Girl, no. girl, you fine. <laughs> uh, girl, girl, you fine. <laughs> I think Gwen. I think Gwen would uh, take care of that. But anyway, but let's talk. Tell us more about your podcast because that way people can tune in and they can learn from you and uh, Tamala. Is this something that yeah. anybody can do? So tell us about that because, of course, CTW Coaching. It says, "I wish y'all could see how it tastes." And Black Tropical loves the logo. So we Thank do. You. Want CTW, you gonna you gonna rub that to our face the last time. <laughs> <laughs> now, I ain't gonna say it because I don't feel like fighting Tremaine and your mama, but and your mama, you know, be quiet. You know, we can't get none of that food. <laughs> As I was saying, talk to us about the podcast. Uh, how you got it started because other people want to know how can I make this cash flow as well? Yeah, so with podcasting, it was very simple. The first thing we did was we before we had our YouTube page, we recorded the podcast on anchor.fm. Super okay. simple to sign up. You go on there, you record, and then you there, yep. You go on there, you record, and then you post it. And then what I found is that editing video is way easier than editing audio for me. Hmm. And so we decided to turn our podcast into a YouTube channel. Mm -hmm. and then it kind of like evolved into like, I'm a baker and my friend does um, chocolate tear. So she does. Um, Your friend Tamala. Yeah, she does a, um, a chip called Torlitas. It's like a salty, sweet treat. Mm -hmm. And so we both had experience with with this. And so we decided to post demos. We do uh, two demos. <clears throat> she does one and I do one every month. And we decided to do that. And so it kind of evolved from there. Ah, this is nice. So on your podcast, we can look at it. We can see how it works. And like, we, like you're saying, we can see how the food works because... This video that I pulled up, it's a 20 minute video, right? Mm -hmm. And so here we have the two of you talking for a while, but then all of a sudden in that same video, the cameras, it changes. And that's yeah. where we see this one, you're dipping strawberries. So that's where your tutorials come in. We can go to your YouTube channel to find that. 
Yep, you can learn different things, like I said. And then at the end of the year, we take our most popular ones and we turn it into our podcast user cookbook. Okay. Oh, that's so that's how you turn it into a cookbook. Now I sped this up, guys. She's not moving this quickly. Um, <laughs> you know, this is just a demo. But mm -hmm. uh, this is cool. So that's how you're using or you're creating more than one thing at a time. That's your plan. And I didn't know that your husband has a podcast as well. Wait, say what? Yes, he does. <laughs> <laughs> my That's, husband has a podcast as well how to catch your mate on a cruise ship <laughs> All right. there you go and G Albert did have a question for you. Do you have a live stream coach? Did, did you have a web presentation coach or was this all you because you are multi-talented? Um, nope, I don't have a live stream coach or a web presentation coach mm, but um Okay, let me just get back here to your mom. I was going to say, but um, you and Taylor, I mean, you and Tamala are from two different states, according to your mom. So, yeah. So me and Tamala actually have never met in person, but we have become great friends and we um, have been doing this podcast for over a year. So we just oh. had our one year anniversary in December and we do, we record our podcast via Zoom. And then I edit it and then upload it to YouTube. We also have other special guests that we have that are in the baking industry. We've had someone who owns a beauty supply store. Um, and so we just, that's how we meet. We connect with different people via Instagram or Facebook. And uh, last month we spotlighted uh, black treat makers throughout the month of February. So, oh, so that's fun. So Taylor Sweet Spirit Treats is really doing a lot of sweet things for everyone. Um, we do have Sec Amethyst here uh, today, hey, saying sec. yes, as well as Lash's Journey. Lash, yes. uh, oh, Caribbean is three. three. I know she's Jamaican, so I don't know. I'm, I think I'm still Nigerian, though. Valerie Singleton is saying that is awesome. I love it. You guys know that we are getting to the top of the hour. That means you got to enter in your second hashtag. So let's enter in Taylor Sweet Treat. I mean, yeah. Sweet Spirit, or should it be Sweet Spirit Treats? What do you want, uh, Taylor? Taylor, Sweet Spirit or Sweet Spirit Obviously, Treats? Uh, Sweet Spirit Treats. Sweet Spirit Sweet Treats. Spirit treats. Okay. Because if we put that in, we probably will be able to find you most places. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Got it. And you know, I did put your YouTube channel into the chat, but Gail at Night will make it pretty because she was asking about that part. And so uh, definitely <laughs> you guys can have all of these things. They're in the show notes because remember, we were talking about Easy Tree, and so with Easy Tree, you can link so many things. It's like a one-stop shop for your website. Mm -hmm. So, for example, this book here, your the podcast dessert cookbook. You said you created this by collecting your favorite twelve recipes. Like, I guess one from each month, or is that how you yep. did it? Yep, okay. that's how we did it. One from each month. Nice. And then here you have the landing page for it. Now this page here, it tells about the authors. It takes us to the podcast if we want to go there. And there's a checkout page. Is all of this through Easy Tree, or is this through a different shopping cart? No, this is through a different shopping cart. Okay. So Sam Cart, I think, is what this yep. is. Cart. Got it. Yep. There are so many shopping carts that we can use. Did somebody recommend this one, or did you find out about it just, you know, looking around? Well, um. Like I said, I met Tamla through a program uh, because I believe in education um, in this industry. And so I have had several people that I have worked with. And so we, we joined a program together and they taught us how to use different tools such as that's where I met um, Shawnee that does the Easy Tree mm -hmm. and as well as learn different payment platforms like SamCart and how to connect them all. All right. Nice. Is so that, you education. Wanna, you yes. want to share the name of that program or that that, uh, that you learned from? Yeah. So it was uh, called Instacoin with okay. a, a lady named King Ashley Ann. Mm. Okay. Is it is it an ongoing program? Because you know a lot of people are wondering: Should I do coaching? Should I do consultation? Should I take classes? Should I take coaching? You had already gone to culinary school, but you said, let me do more education. Through Instacoin. Right, through Instacoin and through YouTube University, you were using all that you had. So is this a program that continues like she does it every so often? What, what you know? Um, 
the program, I believe, is only accessible certain times of the year, and mm-hmm. you stay in the program for a year, and then you are, um, and then you kind of like you can rejoin and you can go about it that way. But I want to tell you guys about one person that has been consistent in coaching like my whole life, and that is CTW Coaching, which mm. has changed the world coaching by my sister, Tequila, who offers <laughs> up advice, and now I have to pay her for it because she is a business <laughs> owner. Okay? But she is so helpful. Um, she does great things. Anybody that needs any type of encouragement, you can contact her at CTW Coaching. Ah, oh, so that's where, okay, so... CTW Coaching's YouTube channel um, is there. We can start there then? Yep. Or you can go to her um, Facebook or Instagram. But she likes TikTok the most. So any of those platforms, you can find CTW Coaching. Got it. Okay. And you know, CTW, you got to round out the crew because we already had Tremaine, big guy Jerry, and we got Taylor. So we got to have CTW Coaching come on. Absolutely. Tremaine already told me how the coaching works. If you do not start that easy tree, my sister, you're going to have a problem with me. <laughs> okay, I'll do it. <laughs> so, uh, you know, XDMC has a question now. While he's. Let while... me guess. I noticed on your wall back there that there's a. <laughs> no, because. Uh, What's his name already? A, uh, a, a compliment her on the. Uh, yes. Friday. So while I show these baked goods, since Wally was asking about cookies, I'll ask this: Do you bake with CBD or THC? Asking for a friend, me. <laughs> <laughs> no, I have not gotten into that. I don't. I don't think I will though. Okay. All right. So mm-hmm. this these cookies though are these plant based? Because I know you do make plant based sweets from what we showed on your um, menu on and your we, online ordering. And we also want to talk about the reason why you would this. Included plant-based uh, sweets into your uh, your repertoire. Yes. Is there any particular reason? Because you you still bake traditional goods as well as uh, plant-based goods that don't have any dairy or animal mm-hmm. products in them. I should say. Was there any particular reason that you chose to go that route? Yes. So basically, because of my family, my um my brother, first of all, big guy journey. He mm-hmm. is. We used to say he was allergic to everything under the sun. Mm -hmm. Um, And so because of him and then my niece, um, my little niece, Brooklyn, she is um, seven years old now. And we wanted to give her the opportunity to have beautiful sweets and treats as well as the other children. And so um, I was making, you know, cakes and stuff. And then we found out that she couldn't have certain things either. And so just to help out with um, learning different things. I was able to make plant-based treats for them as well. Nice. All right, cool. So looking out for family, but then you find out there's a great demand for that across the country. Mm-hmm. So yeah, you, you posi- by looking out for your family, you position yourself to be more profitable by having those opportunities. And like I said, you know, Desserts ranging from cookies to sweet potato pound cakes to pineapple upside down cakes without the coconut flakes. Uh, <laughs> oh, here's that sweet potato pound. Um, the, yep, <laughs> sweet, sweet potato pound cake. She's got a picture of it on her Instagram. I think that's as close as we're going to get to it. But the description does say no corn, no nuts, eggs, gluten, dairy. Mm. So does does that mean there's no eggs, no gluten, and no dairy, or it does have no corn, no nuts, but it does have eggs, gluten, and dairy? No, no corn, nuts, egg, gluten, dairy, none of the top eight allergens. Ah, nice. All right. Wonderful. So we can really enjoy some stuff here. This is good. Uh, We we have enjoyed this. We are at the top of the hour. We got to do our second giveaway. And our second giveaway uh, is for what? Um... This is from Taylor's Kitchen. Mm-hmm. We have to, she's going to let you guys make a decision on what she bakes next. Do you typically name your treats? Uh sometimes I do put out um a menu every month and they ask her about red velvet cookies. Red velvet cookies. So I red put out um a menu every month and I offer that to like my people that are close to me and so they know not close to me, but are in the area that I that don't mm-hmm. require shipping. And so I present mm-hmm. that to them and they like it because it gives them like options as well as the things that they are used to having for me. Right. Okay. So in that case, then they get to make a decision on one of the one of what you're gonna include 
um, with that next Bake Off. So one of your popular, what are two of your popular items that people love? Because Wally's trying to figure out what's in the, what you're baking the cake with if you don't have all of that stuff. You saw it, Wally. It looks delicious. So, yeah. and there will not be a Bake Off XDMC. I ain't competing with her. <laughs> <laughs> I say we do it. <laughs> um, I, I did want to ask one question, though. Um, before we <laughs> right, right. Before we get to the two popular things that people ask for, because that's what the giveaway is going to be. They're going to be able to choose which which one you feature. Yes, which one you feature for the next Bake Off. Taylor, are there any opportunities or openings for taste testers outside of the family? Ask for Corey and Queen's favorite moderator. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to Go ahead. What are the two favorite things? Because Black Tropical is putting in their bid. My, that yes, strawberry shortcake cupcake. All my fluffing is coming out. <laughs> <laughs> so um, I believe the two most popular things may be the red velvet cookie sandwiches that Tremaine uh, put in the comment, or um, the sweet potato pound cake. Right now, okay, so might be the two most popular. All right, so for the next Bake Off then, okay, good, Ms. Eileen has it in. I think we're ready for the giveaway. Somebody is going to decide. Which of those two most popular items, whether it's gonna be a uh, Red Velvet, Vel Red Red Velvet. Velvet. <laughs> cookie sandwich, or the sweet potato pound cake that's gonna be featured on the next menu that she puts out for her local customer crew. All right. So how are we going to say this, Corey? Because I got it pulled up. Some people have already put it in correctly. They got the hashtag. They have Sweet Spirit Treats in there. So what we're going to do is I'm going to say three, two, and one. And she's going to say Sweet Spirit Treats. All right. Let's All go right. for it. Three, two, one. Sweet Spirit Treats. All right, and we're off. Cassandra Dominic, Eileen Williams, CTW Coach and Tamla. Wait, her whole family in there. Wally, mm -hmm. Eileen, uh, <laughs> uh, T-shirt to one, Black Tropical, FR Humphrey. T -t no way, CTW Coaching. <laughs> this is what they mean by Rick and Monroe. This congratulations. Is no, no. Me, she well, already congratulated the family. This is Rick and Monroe and it's fine. Whatever Rigor Monroe is, this is Rigor Monroe. Oh, wow. Congratulations, CTW Coaching. You guys, I said at the top of the show, her family, they are winners. And look, this is it. This is Rigor Monroe. Sorry, show. Duval. You almost made it again. Duval City Girl Gardener. We tried. <laughs> this is more rigged than attract the trail right here. Well, you know what? <laughs> Tamala says those these cookies are the absolute, they are 100. She got love for those cookies. But I'm going to tell you, Tamala, I got an idea for y'all to ramp up y'all video podcast. Change yeah. your name, Tamala Skywalker, and then <laughs> put on a bikini. <laughs> And like, uh, uh, bake with it. Go ahead, and cook with it. Go ahead, and cook with it. Dip the chocolate, cook with it. Uh, anyway, the whole entire pound cake. right. CTW, forget that mini. Get the whole entire pound cake. You know what? So this is the thing. Audrey Willis is saying congratulations. However, Philip Baldo is like, Wally and David, speak now, please. Because <laughs> even we think it's rigged. Yeah, she up this my pound cake, pound cake. So that's her vote. <laughs> she votes for the pound cake on the next Bake Off. Uh, Black Tropical is saying, congratulations. Y'all know we're going to be in a battle with them tomorrow night. Talk with Tori, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, I think. OG Patrice is saying, uh, salute to XDMC. They're all... Oh, look at Miss Eileen. It's not rigged. We are just blessed. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> See, yeah, she could throw the Lord in it and just shut everybody down. <laughs> right. <laughs> Miriam, you back just in time from your premiere. Y'all know Mary Marty pulled you does videos on grants. Your family are winners. Go to her channel. Mary Marty pulled you. She has so many uh, videos telling you how to win a grant, the expiration date, some of some of the are for studies, business opportunities, business owners, startups schooling of different types um what else are there corey um, fellowships it's so many opportunities a lot of opportunities that she i'll does. definitely go check it out yes and so she always schedules her premiere she's nigerian they about the money girl get over there get find something good <laughs> i'm gonna say this before we actually uh get too far before we go miss Eileen. Your son and your daughter and your grandchildren and i'm gonna assume the ctw is the same you have raised some wonderful people mm, in your family. They yes. are such wonderful people. I enjoy talking to them. Even the grandbabies are, are, are a joy to talk Sweet to. Sweethearts. So 
that speaks to you as a mother. Mm. So congratulations to you. You are truly a first place pony. You are when it comes to motherhood, you have done your thing. Yes, ma'am. We appreciate you. Uh, we do have one final question before you go. Uh, of course, we are about to go into our plant-based treats. So we do have to ask how many fruits and vegetables you've had today, but or whole grains. Or whole grains but XDMC says, do you ship? I want to order some cookies for my favorite mod and sister Gail at night, and I want a sweet potato pancake. So <laughs> Do you ship outside of where you are? What's you make some exceptions to the rules right now. <laughs> I may, I may make some exceptions to the rules. I mm -hmm. just, you gotta follow me on Instagram and Facebook, and I will see and message me. Okay, okay. Right. And you know what? OG Patrice and changed her picture too. Everybody getting cute or cuter, I should say. All right, Gail at Midas saying thank you, but we got to get the answer to this question before we show our plant based treat. How many fruits, vegetables, or whole grains have you eaten today, Taylor? I actually didn't eat anything yet. I just drank some water. So, oh. hey, that water's always good. That's so, got plenty of time to get it in today. So, when you get a chance, make sure you. Make sure you get some fruits, vegetables, and whole grains. In. But what we're gonna do is right now, Miss Eileen says thank you. Praises to Yahweh. Oh, okay. Thank you, Miss Eileen. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna um, put you back in the green room. We're gonna see if you can hang out for a moment because we're gonna talk to you once this broadcast is over. Okay. <laughs> All right. All right. We'll see you soon. Okay. They still talking trash. Philip to my ex DMC. I'm not your sister, man, because he want the cake instead of get. Yes. Corey, introduce the plant-based treat because it's a sweet one today. And now it's time for today's plant-based treat by Chef LaQuita Marie. Oatmeal breakfast cookies. We're going to get these breakfast cookies started with two cups of oats, half a cup of sunflower butter. Chemicals in sunflower seeds stop the growth of cancer cells, helping to fight colon, prostate, and breast cancer. Blended the bananas and the dates. So I'm going to pour out what looks like about, like about three bananas, I should say. You could just use three bananas, but we added dates because they're natural sweeteners that are rich in fiber and high in iron. It does regulate blood sugar. So I'm going to pour this onto the spoon so I can get about a teaspoon of cinnamon. I have about a half cup of nuts that I'm adding there. A whole cup of nuts. Walnuts are a great source of fiber. They promote heart health and provide antioxidants that fight dementia. Pop it down onto the baking sheet like that. All right, so we just flatten these out a little bit. We're gonna pop them in the oven. Bake on 350 for seven to nine minutes. It tastes delicious. Corey, here, taste this. It's just right for breakfast. You got the right amount of sweetness. The nuts make it really crunchy and give you a lot of different textures. It's good. It's a good breakfast treat. To me, these look like dog food, so I made a quick chocolate sauce with cacao powder. Mmm. It's actually really good. Mm -hmm. They're actually really good. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all. I know that's not a sweet spirit treat, but you know what I mean? I did my thing. Even took off the dog food look, so with the chocolate sauce. Yeah. <laughs> it's just right for me because, you know, I'm the atomic. Oh, you know what? <laughs> CTW said this has been so awesome. And so uh, thank you, Gail at Night, for Mary Amade Poju for dropping her link. We do appreciate that because Miriam is bringing us some good stuff on how to win, how to be successful. Of course, Big Guy Journey is chatting it up with everybody, but we got to go, guys. It's been over an hour and no okra says, despite my name, I'm plant-based. <laughs> so <laughs> true that while they get out of here, see, this is why we don't... This is why we always fight and while it's my uh those measurements are slightly off. <laughs> <laughs> petty. Well, you the name not you because you are a chief petty officer. Ah, <laughs> uh, I am too, Wally. But oh, oh I gotta straighten up. Afroscope TV, hello, greetings. This is how we normally are, sweet and nice and good. Um, we get people that throw us off every now and then, but thank you. They call me Sunshine says those cookies look like you can eat them out of the bowl. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah they were delicious. Like I said, get a hot cup of coffee with them. Boy, that's a good breakfast treat. Yes, there will be no bake off because y'all saw Taylor's food. Y'all saw mine. Sweet but spirit street, sweet spirit treats are way better looking every time. But there will be a competition tomorrow. Everybody <laughs> tune in to talk with Tori. Talk with Tori is gonna feature it's gonna be a battle royal. If you guys remember WWF, it's gonna be the Royal Rumble, the Cage Match. The bunkhouse stampede. As we Black's doing all that. Mm -hmm. As Black's tropical and Black got his wife go head to head, toe to toe, and we're gonna see just how much help I gotta give Laquita with reading. 
<laughs> thank you, Tamala Walker. She says, thank you. Enjoy no, the presentation. Tamala oh, Tamala Skywalker. Uh, oh, thank you. Miss Eileen says we're awesome. Oh, you know what? I forgot. Easy Tree will link you to other people's pages. Remember how we found easy Tamala's Easy Tree because it was linked to Taylor's Easy Tree. To Taylor's Easy Tree. Yes, guys. You have to get this. It's a great way to do business and network with each other so that you can be awesome like uh, like us. I mean, I didn't say it. Miss Eileen said it. So, hey, so let's she, go because they, they got the glove, boxing gloves. Out. Okay. Okay. That's y'all. Yes. Uh, what? what oh, oh, she get raw like that? All right. I ain't scared of Bobby. I don't care if he is built like the Incredible Hulk <laughs> and I ain't built like the Incredible What the Hell. That, that, <laughs> this is a daytime that, show. Be quiet. Well, Miss Eileen, listen. Look, I, I, look I, I'm ready for it. I'm ready for it. You know? Audrey Villas can't wait. And uh, you know what? While they're trying to give me bacon tips, I'm out. I'm out. How do we say goodbye, Corey? To my, that's why you got to put it in a pan so we can get its edges. <laughs> well, thank you guys for joining us on this edition of The Blind Guy. His wife. Your life. Live. Life. Join us tomorrow because we're going to talk about how you can conquer the algorithm mm. and get to connect with your audience on a larger basis with master communication specialist and branding specialist, Sanal. So hey. you don't want to miss that tomorrow. And then, of course, Friday, we have our YouTube Yellow Pages Game Show Trivia. We're going to feature James Cooper. We're going to feature X, MMC. And we're also going to feature... Kwame's Trading. Kwame's Trading on our YouTube Yellow Pages. So with that being said, we're going to say... Wait, wait, wait. Before we say goodbye, you know, we got to say hello to my South African fam. We're going to talk with Ntavi. You already know we're who it talk is. With <laughs> I'm telling you guys, we we are putting together... Don't tell them. No I'm secrets. Gonna, no secrets. Nah, no, we got to go. I'm just not, say goodbye. I'm just say this. But it's going to be a Voltron effect that's coming together in under under one banner. We're not going to tell you what it is, but yeah, it's going to be... Uh, Y'all know Ntavi did our intro video. She's amazing. She does websites. Anyways, let's go, Corey. How do we say it? We say goodbye by saying <laughs> deuces <laughs> until tomorrow. <laughs>